But um, I think that we went offline again. That that was ac- that was actually my fault. My that time. Okay. But um, okay. So I have noticed that no one. Like, okay, Dame has actually been punishing more than Lex. Listen, Afro, my finger, I sneezed. <laughs> Dame, Dame's had some pretty optimal punish, punishment so far. And that's already way more than what I had expected. Yeah, yeah we're about to get into game three if these guys will ready up. We Dame need more ready. back three. Dame, ready up. <laughs> All right. Damien, we need you to ready ready up, please. Like, sir, he's pulling out his notepad. I already know. Does Dame have a notepad for Tekken? I... Oh, it's not letting him ready up, really? Okay. That's strange. <laughs> no, um... Spirit, Spirit was having the same problem. Spirit and um, Lotus was having the same problem. So. Alright, I guess we're going to be cycling one more time. Um, Lex. I am going to assume that Big Dame is going to want to pick Jungle Outpost. So. Yeah, D- Dame is a, he's a Jungle outpo- Outpost guy. So whenever you get the opportunity... If you get the opportunity to pick the stage again, that's what you should be picking. I'm sorry, Jungle Outpost 2, because it makes a difference. Yeah, I mean, that music does make a difference. Does it? Nah, not really, but like, I, I prefer 2 over 1. I never listen to the actual game music. I usually just have Spotify going in the background. Really? But anyway, guys, just remember, if you like the stream, uh, if you like seeing cheese steaks and throw just make sure that you're following the channel. We do this every weekend for you guys. Saturdays, we host it for PSN. Sundays, we do it for PC. There's a sign-up sheet in the Discord. Um, Afro is here in the chat with us, so if you're interested now, you can sign up. He can post the link in the chat for you guys. But... Yeah, we're, this is... I'm actually super hyped to see what Dame does to get himself back into the game. Because it's not like he was doing too much wrong in the last game. So, we'll see what he has up his sleeve this time around. Yeah. <laughs> so... Hopefully, I'm pretty sure we should be going to Jungle Outpost 2. So what do you think Big Dame should do? Since th- since that's your man for this set, what do you think Big Dame needs to do to, to get himself another win on the board? I feel like he's been playing fine like that. He just barely... like He, he read the spring kick the one time and just punished late. And then he just got... I forget what happened in the last round, but like I don't think Dame needs to make a big adjustment. He just needs to make sure he is reacting fast enough for, for some of these whiffs. And uh, because his his black punishment and his throw break has been on point so far, so I can't say anything about that. So, um, I think he's playing fine. Well, we'll have to see if he keeps playing that way, but I don't think I don't think there's much needed for Dame right now. I think he's still in the driver's seat. So. Um, I could be wrong though. We I want to see him throw more. Fight. Lex yeah, hasn't been breaking the throws, but he's been lucky enough to hold down with the two throw. So I want to see more throws. Yes, if anything, maybe just like be a little bit more patient because he can like that power crush right there is minus fourteen. I'm not sure what Link's fourteen frame punishes, but oh, she actually gets a full launcher at fourteen frames. It's a uh, standing three. Oh, okay, so that works. And yeah, look so at that throws. Oh god. Wow! Full screen lows! 
He wow. believed hard in that, man. He didn't even have to do that. I mean, it would have good spacing. Is that it might? I don't know if that's a low that Link can make like semi safer if she spaces it well. Well, no, it's a stagger low, isn't it? I guess stagger. Okay, never mind then. Good job, the Lex staying down on the ground. He knows the tech. And a back three with punish. Who would have thought that wall that wall move would put enough give him enough pushback for that back three to work? All right, so Dan needs to duck that string because that second is a high. Yeah, definitely needs to duck that. Oh, here we go. Big team breaking throws. I told, I, I'm telling you, if he just stays a little bit more patient. Good block on the rage drive. Wall bounce. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. Team. Big team. <laughs> oh my god. Dave the god. I told you, man. I, I said Dave was fine. Dave the god. I, I'm really just floored at his throw breaking. Like, listen, he. How many throw attempts did he break before getting that throw? Like, he's broken, he's broken a lot of them. All right, good block, no punish. Nice duck, and another Damn. duck, no punishment. Oh, Dame had the right idea. I had, that happens to me a lot. Fight. Gotta, gotta believe in your duck. Gotta believe and he's mashing. We out here mashing today. No mashing punish the on the launcher. But Dame broke a throw again. Okay, Dame. Dame's seeing these hands on these throws, man. Because how wrong? He's not like a generic throw character. He has like at least three command throws, I think. Or yeah, he has two at least. He has, has two. two of the three for sure. Yeah. Did you just see that? Wow, he man, he did back one right after his orbital. Well then, big team going up two to one. I'm so proud. Lex, I need you to pull it together. My man Dame, though, my man Dame breaking throws out here. That's why I want to see Dame. That's what I'm talking about. Because like, how wrong? Like his throw, his throw game's nice. Because like you get hit by that two throw, that's a free back three, and then if you tech in incorrectly after getting hit by one plus two, you could still eat a back three and get your ass launched for it. So Dame is doing the right thing right now. So oh, oh wait, how wrong has four command throws? Man, fuck you, Blitz. <sighs> and I just want to know how you don't win if you have four command throws. Like, what are you doing, Blitz? You got more command throws than Dragon off. Uh, no, he doesn't. He has the same. Drag has the tackle. Oh, yeah. He has tackle, and then he has that jumping like crap. All right, so, all right, fair enough. He has one less than Dragon. Well, that's an attack throw, and it doesn't count. He d he has one for each. He has one throw for each break, and then the tackle. So that's four. He should have just kept the throw breaking the same way as it was in, t in Tag 2. Was Were the windows, like, wider in Tag 2? Wasn't it where, like, uh, you had to break one with one and two with two? Oh, it wasn't, um, everyone basically had a throw mix-up? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah no, yes. Had. And then the throw break window was, like, how Fakram's throw was before it got nerfed. I didn't even realize throw breaking was that hard back then. My dude, I have been playing Tag 2 recently, and I haven't been playing Tekken at all, and I'm still breaking like 75% of throws and I'm like alright maybe I'm just got like but yeah apparently that's why everyone was saying like when Fakaram had his one throw his one plus two throw that no one could break they're like well it was like this in tag two I'm like really oh yeah Damn. tag two was throws mattered that's all that's what happens when you spend when you spend five years playing one game you don't realize how how much worse things were back in the day well, actually, I mean, like, I wouldn't say worse. I mean, people were breaking throws a lot back in Tag 2, but that bigger th that bigger window made a pretty big difference, I guess, because a lot of people was not... People complained so much about that throw that it got nerfed, which is... I mean, if it didn't wall splat, I'd feel like it would have been fine. Well, when you think about it in the sense of... It wasn't the same as the other throws, like... Okay, you have some pretty unique throws in the game that are that have quicker throw breaks, like you know, giant sling, stuff like that. But it was just a regular one plus two throw that just happened to not have the same break window. 
So I feel like that was something that should have been adjusted anyway. He's not punishing Cali roll, it's minus 10. Cali roll's minus 10. Yeah, if you have a good jab string, you can definitely punish her. He's dead. Dame popping off two. right now. Fight. Alright, he's let him lift back three for free. Everyone gets one. Nice duck. Oh, wow. AOP? And this is what I'm talking about. Like, how do you lock Dane down long enough to get down 3 4? Well, if you play Lars, just down 4 2 and you're good. Dude, Lars, Lars shits on this character. This is the third time he's blocked back turn 4 and has not launched him with back 3. Lex, I need you to kill Dane for these mistakes. Nice. You're fighting yourself out of a hole each time, not taking the free damage that's being given to you. But a nice my down 4-4. Four, four. My man, Dame popping off right now. Keep keep doing you, Dame. Keep going. Keep, oh, wow. Nice combo. Okay, Dame. Alright, no punish on the firecracker. Yeah, that, that low. Yeah, yeah firecracker. Dame punished back three! I can't. I can't. <laughs> I can't anymore. Dame, so. Oh, uh, oh my god, Dame is going off. Okay, we punish, we punish Stagger loads of grabs. Yo, Dame punished back three. I, I saw that. That was nice. I barely punished back three. <laughs> Dame, go off, King. Go off. Like, he, he's up 3-1. He's up to 3-1. I, I, I... <laughs> Stagger low punish with throw. This <laughs> <laughs> is a new strat, man. Or you just block like a minus 13 string and you hell sweep like Crimson does. Oh, oh my... I, I can't. This is this is actually too much for me. Is this going to be a 5-1? Is this going to be 5-1? The, the way it's going now, uh, the momentum is definitely in his favor. And... Man, yeah. Dame, about to give, Dame about to give all y'all the hands in IPP, man. Y'all better look out for Dame. Dame is about to never let you guys live it down that he won the run back. So, Lex, I'm going to need you to pull it together. Because we can't have Dame frolicking around the Discord saying how he won on PC. We can't have this. And everyone in the chat knows what, I, what's, what I'm talking about. Like, they know what's going to happen. I just hit my headset. So... Dane trying to run away with this. Oh, 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 I love it. Lex said he is definitely not scared. Let's go. Yeah, let's get it, Lex. I, I want to see this comeback, man. Show me that you're not scared. Show me. But here we go. Game number five. Oh, my God. Reckless with the puns. <sighs> who's who's going to shoot reckless? Is it is it Afro? Afro are you going to shoot? Please punish per buttons. <laughs> well, I mean like a We saw the big brain strat. We saw punishing stagger low with throw. <laughs> Let me stop. Let me stop. Yeah, the, the only, uh, like, the biggest, like, the biggest spot where you can, like, actually punish Ling is, like, her back turn four when, from, like, standing. Like, her, a couple of her lows are, like, launch punish, but, like, most of her mids are, like, only, like, minus 12 in most cases. So, like, you really gotta capitalize on the situations where Dane puts himself out there with the... Okay. There we go, backlash. Actually, it would probably help Lex if he used more backlash and FF4. Yeah, cause I'm. Oh, he's mixing them. Nice. Yep, that's exactly. That was a that was a confidence builder right there, Lex. I like it. Down four, one three is like the ultimate 
close out tool. I don't know why. It's like such a weird string. No He's dog. mashing. Stop mashing. What the... All right, we gotta punish this time. Wow. Oh my god, that's dirty. That's so dirty. And Dame in prime position. Wow, I didn't even know her spring kick could do that. Yeah. Fight. <laughs> he finally did it. All right, Lex. Lex is back in this set. Lex is back. There's a call. He's like, my man, you are not doing this all day. That's okay. Steel net still downloading. That's fine. Oh, that's not that point. punishable, sir. Was it minus 12? Uh, no, I'm pretty sure that is safe. <laughs> wow. Lex, you gotta stop doing these highs, man. You gotta stop. I think he's just grabbing at the wrong times. What a whiff punish! Let's go, dude! Okay, I was about to say good punish, but... Uh, no, it's minus 13, I think, when it's in that posi in that situation. I think it's just 12. I think it's 12. Blitz, okay. 13 Funny. or 12, you gotta let us know. I'm pretty sure it's 12. No duck All right. again. No duck here. No punish. It's minus 10. Alright. Hey, so hey, how it's only minus 10, but... No back three! Oh, back turn four is my. Oh, you were right. It's minus 12. Oh, he's dead. Oh, no duck again. Lexi got duck that string, bro. Oh my gosh. He. Whatever, a break. He needed that. Okay. Dane, don't hit a buttons. I'm pretty. Can Link AOP underneath that? I wouldn't try that. I'm only asking because. Alright, Dane won this. Dane, what the times? I'm so proud. I'm so proud. He stayed on the ground. I'm so proud I'm of you, Dave. Because Lars can up for three under how wrong's rage art. So I feel like I feel like Link could possibly AOP under. Oh my gosh. Dame with the timeout. I am floored. Average video game, Joe. Thank you so much for the host, my dude. Guys, welcome to Iron Fist Philly Cheesesteaks and Throw Breaks, where we have training first of five sessions for you guys with commentary so that you guys can look back on your videos and have some guidance on how you can improve in these sets. Right now, you guys are joining us in our main event, which is Big Dame 21, a Philly faithful against Lex Steele. Um, currently up 4 1. Big Dame, man. Big Dame out here. I didn't see this coming at all. I I I need I need Dame to close out the set. I, I need him to close out the set. Dame has, Dame is leveled up. I uh, he he definitely at least in this matchup he definitely has. And I was not prepared for it. So Lex Steele on his very very last uh, legs. And what what adjustments do you think he can make, Bufflars? Enlighten us. He's not ducking like some of these strings that Dave's throwing out, he's not ducking them enough, so actually well not ducking them at all. I would I would honestly just give up on throwing because every time he tries throwing, Dame's either A not close enough to get thrown or B he's AOPing he's AOPing under the throw so it's either he needs to switch up when he wants to throw because it seems like he's always trying to throw when like he blocks a move instead of um instead of just like punishing like I think he's like unsure on how to punish stuff so he's just opting with a throw so I wouldn't I wouldn't recommend doing that so if he can like duck underneath some of these strings and just like even like even with a jab, I, I feel like a, j a jab is a better option than going for a throw on some of these punishment because Dame's just it's giving Dame room to like mash AOP when he goes for a throw. So and Dame's, and Dame's breaking throws anyway. So I personally think that um, your suggestion for him to just I'm not, not throw at all, like I don't. Like, the, he's trying oh. to throw a lot and getting minimal reward off of it. Fight. So... Or maybe just, like, switch up when he wants to throw. It's probably better wording for it. No punish there. I think that's, like, minus 10. 
Actually, I, I can pull the frame data on Wow. The Excellently timed AOP under down 3 4. Yo. I spec 3. I'm always talking about, like, I think this is this unsafe one. I can hit frame data on my screen. That is true. Yeah. Right, that's my that's not the punish. Maybe. No duck. Like, for example, right there, he's got to duck that. Dame's been doing that all set. All right, nice. Nice job, Lex. All right, Lex. Working his way back in. Building the confidence. Giving him a nice clean whip punish. Back three. Oh, yeah. If he starts sucking these strings, then Dame has to think about his options more. Because, like, Dame hasn't really been given a reason to switch up anything he's been doing. So, Lex needs to... Okay. All right, nice job, Lex. Lex needs to tell Dame, listen... You can't be doing this all day on me. And oh. another size up AOP. Now right this is... Now. Wow, right under the power crush once again. Doesn't break the throw, but no Oki for him. Oh, he gets a throw. Bad way to get up from Big Dame. There it is. We, we expose Dame right now. Persistence wearing down resistance. Alright, nice job. Very nice job. I mean, he charged you! Yo! He's oh my god. Four. My man's was down 4 to 1 and he key charged. He's like, hold on though. <laughs> Yo! We, we are back. Oh my gosh. You better bring it yeah. all Lex, the way you gotta, back. You gotta win now. You gotta win now, Lex. I'm sorry. If you lose after that key charge, I'm sorry, bro. But you, got, you gotta win now after that. Like... You just said, yo, Big Dave, so, Big Dave was like, okay, key charge, I see you. Okay, um, okay. I, I have nothing to say, I just, on to the next game. Welcome, MT, thank you, thank you for stopping by. Thank you for the follow, MT, good to see you. I'm sorry, that was hilarious. He, my man's key charged when he's down four to two. I respect it. I respect it. He's like, I got life. We, we still have life. He's and he like, knows. He says, Dame, I want you to pick Jungle Outpost too. Like, oh man. I mean, like, Jungle Outpost is a good stage for How Wrong anyway, because if How Wrong has the pressure at the wall, he could just do like down three, four, or I mean, down four, three in the hell sweep. That's a, and that's how a wall break, so. I mean, it's a good stage for wrong. It's not a bad stage. Well, I think... So, Jungle Outpost to Dame is kind of like what, like, infinite stages are to me. It's just the confidence boost. It's the stage that you like, that you can vibe with. So... Yeah, I mean, that's that's why I usually pick. I usually pick Jungle Outpost, too. So... Either that, or I've been liking... I kind of like, I like Mishima Dojo at times, but like, I don't know, it depends on the matchup. I don't really, I usually just opt with infinite stage against a lot of characters when I realize they have better wall Oki or like wall mix-ups than I do. Because I'm like, I mean, like, yeah, I get big damage with Lars at the wall, but after I get my damage, I don't, I really have to go above and beyond to like keep them at the wall. So I'm, I'd rather opt with just like infinite stages instead. I That's just opt for infinite stage because I dare you to beat me in neutral. I dare you. <laughs> I dare you play better. You're only winning because of the wall. Now fight me like a man. But now, if, like if I wanted a stage where I wanted space and still have walls, I'd probably just go with like a uh, Duomo de Serio. That or that's all. I like that. That's still a very. That's an underrated stage. Tinder uh, gym. Fight. I usually go Precipice of Fate or like Forgotten Temple. Cause they, you those really? Oh, Forgotten Temple, okay. Yeah, those are some pretty big stages. No, not Forgotten Realm, fuck that. As a Lars main, Forgotten Realm does not help us. All right, wow, good block, no launch, but he still got a nice punish. Speaking of Hell Sweep, there it is, I mentioned it. Like at, at the wall, you gotta watch out for that. Dame right, mash down. that time, down 3 4. Drops the combo. Wow! Dame! What a step, Dame! Oh my god, that was amazing. Alright, Lex is really saving himself by holding down after that two throw, and I'm 
very impressed, even though he's not breaking the throw. Like, that is some consistency. Oh. Hunting Hawk! Deep ducked! I thought Dave was on a master rage heart. I mean, in that scenario, it probably would have worked. Just because of how long um, Hunting Hawk would have taken. That's only minus 9? Wow. That's crazy. I thought it was minus 12. Wow, alright, Big Dane getting himself some momentum. Dude, his AOP went on their Wow. Uh, Punishable move, duck, and throw. It's bad for Dame. That instant running 3. You gotta look out for that. He, he's got them instant running 3s ready. Alright, nice down jab. And a good with punish. Big Dame saying he wants to close out the set now. Yeah, if I, if, I think Lex needs to be like a little bit more patient after he gets hit on Dame because Dame's always looking to oh wow Dame's always looking to go to AOP oh he might be in big trouble right here. All right, he already used this. Oh my God, there it is! There it is! The Dame spell. Well, that's not the Dame special, but slash the four. Snake Edge, we out here with the Snake Edge. Okay. All right, good good job, to Lex. He's not getting counter hit by that string anymore. Still not ducking it though. Wow. All right, nice back one. All right, nice FF four. Yep. Hell sweep. Nice. The blitz special. All right, this looks like Lex's round. DF one to close it out. Lex needs this round. DF one three. It's such a great, great start for Dean. Such a great closeout. Sword. What a bait! What a bait! And he's getting wall damage. Okay, that was that was sneaky, Dame. I see. Dangerous. Guaranteed. He's like, you gonna key charge me? Let me disrespect you real quick. Nice punish on the. Oh, oh he tried to size stuff for again. Dame, Dame, Lex, you have rage. You just need one launch. Oh, that's game. <laughs> Let's go, Dame. 